Hey YouTube, how's it going? Welcome back to today's Pokemon card opening! Today we've got 10 packs of Fates Glycoline 1, which is trade lock because we're te we're still, I don't say testing, but we're examining the theory, further examining the theory of whether or not you're more likely to get good stuff compared to the packs. So far, it does seem like it, because we've gotten a full art Giratina, we've got a full art Mega Gyarados, so it does seem like it is what it is. But we'll give it a shot. And hopefully we get some good out of the other nine packs as well, or at least out of this pack. Plus, I also like getting trade lock packs because they're easier to get as well, because you're just paying like 200 coins. You can e I can easily obtain uh, some verses. And we have White Gear, which is a holographic in this set, so it seems actually... It is a hollow, I know it's a hollow, but it's just very difficult to see the hollow pattern on this. But I know for pets a hollow, because I've gotten like two, three copies of this card somewhere. At one point I had four of this, I think. Um... What was I gonna say? I forget. But yeah, there's something about, like, holes. We got holes in the past. Like, good stuff in the past. And it's nice to have stuff that I don't have to necessarily trade. feel like I have to trade, like, so I can use it in actual games and stuff. Ooh, Dancy EX. Yeah, we got a we got a hollow. I mean, hollow. Uh, 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 an EX. So that's second pack in EX. One hollow on EX so far. Um, sounds like we have any damage done to your attack. Is reduced by thirty. So this is like as long as it's based. It says oh done to your Pokemon. You could just say this Pokemon. Any damage done to this Pokemon is reduced by thirty after applying moves and resistance. You don't have to put all that other shit because of course it's going to be your active Pokemon if this Pokemon has a. <sighs> now, if it were regardless of what Pokemon was active, this would be pretty damn good because you're using a wall deck. But now, I think the Mega Dance is a better at build because it like just completely negates damage from. EXs, like it's just, oh, you're an EX, so well, you're not gonna damage me. Lucario, which is not a hollow in the set. It is in Steam Siege and maybe in Furious Fists, I think. Um, but it's just a regular right here, but it's still a cool card. I still don't understand why coughing is a Sui art in the set. Sui is just like, yeah, I'll do the ugly ones, why not? Rotom. Fuck you, Rotom, I don't give a fuck. Wubble up a dub dub. There's two different Rylos in this set, which is weird because it's Fates Collide, not um, Furious Fists, but okay. Alexam Spritling Reverse, Carbink, that's alright, it's a decent card because um, Crushing Hammer exists and Enhanced Hammer exists. Um, we have a Reverse Hollow, no, it's just a strong energy. We have a Ultra Bolt, those are two great cards. Reverse Hollow Rare Rotom. And a Genesect DX, nice, I like this card. I have the full art of it in my Stir Platinum deck. Again, I love every excuse to say Stir Platinum. Um, Drive Change is great, which is pretty decent. I've never actually used that ability, uh, mostly because my Star Platinum deck doesn't really use tools. It'll probably use like 4 Heart Charm or, um, what's it called? What is that card called? Uh, Finding Fury Bell in the future, because they would like, swap that out, put a uh, different one on. I don't really understand the point of the Pokemon tool thing, to be honest, like being able to ch change them over. I kind of guess they'd be useful sometimes, but not really often. But Rapid Blaster is really good if you want to knock out EXs. It's a one-trick pony, where you just go discard everything. But, it can be good. Aegislash EX is technically better, but it's now an expanded because it's in Phantom Forces, so this is like the replacement. And it's still a decent card, I managed to one-shot a Charizard EX with it, and the guy was like, Fuck. And that basically won the game for me. So it's definitely a good card, and I like the art. I I do like, I think I prefer this art over the uh, full art, to be honest. But let's keep opening some packs here. So we've got two EXs and a hollow so far. Um, Devolution Spray. I've had someone use this, not on me, but like on themselves before within the Moongus deck. It's like, oh, now you can use poison again. Oh. Because there's certain Pokemon, like, when you place it, it's like, oh, this effect, okay. But you can't, like, re-evolve that Pokemon straight afterwards, because that. Um, Zygarde is a relatively good regular rare. In fact, a lot of these sets have decent regular rares. This one, in particular, I think, has some decent ones. Another Suiyard. 
Bronzor. Uh, Whimsicott. I think I have this in my fairy fire deck. Reverse Hollow Rare of Grumpix, so no break. I don't even know there's breaks in this set. I think there's carving break in this set, I swear. A head walking and knockback is terrible. And Reuniclus, which is alright, I guess. It's situational. Um, it's great in like an evolution based deck. If you want like to do the evolution challenges, but it still has some power, it's really good. But other than that, it's situational. Devotion from the same sort of line. A uh, reverse hollow Kangaskhan in common, which is sometimes used. Um, because double colorless energy. And Altari AX, nice. The last time I think I got the uh, the Mega, and now I have the regular, which is pretty cool. Powerful gain, Shining Wind, which is decent. And last pack of the vid. Yeah, I mean, she knows. I'm really sorry. Reverse all energy pouch. That's nice. Another strong energy. Strong is strong. Loudred. I think it's reverse. I like the art. Is that like a kind of Chinese like lantern up there? Huh, I never noticed that before. It's like a Japan style art in the back. I mean, they're all Japan style art, but I mean, like, it looks like it's Japan in the background. Um, and, and finally, we're ending off with another White Curum Hollow. So that's one, two, three X's, two Hollows. So half the pack's been good, essentially, which is good. Um, I think you're supposed to get, like, what is it? Every, like, eight packs should get about an X and two Hollows. In this, we got three and two hollows, one of them being trade locked. So that's actually super decent. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video here. I enjoy making them as always. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment down below what you thought the best pull of video is because we again got some decent contenders. My luck has returned. The pull gods are with me for once. Um, but this is KDJX signing off. Thank you guys for watching once again and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!